Hey guys, it's Liz and today I'm going to be sharing you guys what is in my bag for school. So I'm trying out yet another setup in my dorm room. I think I like this one. You guys are on the microwave and fridge right now. Um, but this way you can see my pretty string lights and you can also see my bed sheet that I'm drying because I washed it. So you win some, you lose some. I originally brought just a plain black backpack to use um, to carry my stuff to and from all my classes and everything, but I really did not enjoy using that, especially with my stuff for my drawing classes. My sketchbook like barely fit in there and it just was not fun to use at all, so instead I decided to stick with using my tote bag, which is a Longchamp Le Pliage, I believe is how you say it. So this is what it looks like. I believe this is the large. I love this. It's just the black one with the brown leather straps and I love this thing so much. So obviously I don't have the same classes every single day so um, my schedule varies throughout the week but for the most part I bring the same stuff to my classes because a lot of my classes I take, I actually don't take any notes on pen and paper. I do all of it on my laptop. So really the biggest class that I have to bring stuff to is my art class. And then other than that, I just sometimes have books that I have to carry around or just small things like that. My biggest thing is my sketchbook and this is a, what is this, 11 by 14 inch sketchbook. So this is a, he's a big guy <laughs> and he really does take up a lot of room. And depending on the class, I might have to also bring my tracing paper or my watercolor paper or other random art supplies. So. I'll throw those in here and they all fit in here and that's great. <laughs> the next biggest thing is just my computer and so I have it in this pink laptop case. It has one zip right here which is really nice and in here I just have my external hard drive. And this is my computer. It's a HP Spectre 360. Um, I just got it over the summer. I really like it other than the fact that my speakers are already broken so I have to send it off over winter break to get it fixed. Next thing I have is my planner and this is from Target. Oh, also, I got that um, laptop case off of Amazon. This is my planner. It's from Target. It's this gold and white design, and it says Day Designer. The gold has scratched off quite a bit, so I'm thinking of doing something to the front of it, like maybe taping it or something, because it's starting to look pretty sad. This is my pencil pouch. Um, like I said earlier, I really do not take notes using pen and paper, but this is everything I need for my art class, basically, plus some. So I have like colored pencils, erasers, um, like special pens and pencils for drawing. Next in here I have headphones, just because you never know when you're gonna need headphones. That's just like a necessity to have. Pretty basic. I have Mott's Medley's Assorted Fruit Snacks. I have so much food. Clarice and I, my roommate and I, we have so much food in our room. We eat so much food and we love food and Food is so good. And I just have chapstick. This is really the only like makeup type item I keep with me. And the last thing I always have with me, of course, is my cell phone. Um, I keep this in a life proof case because I drop it all the time. I'm just walking, it like goes flying out of my hands, which is kind of ridiculous. And off of Amazon, I got this little like pouch thing for me to keep my cards in. I have my room key because here you actually have a key, you don't just have a key card. Um, a ticket from when I took the bus. And then I have, um, I'm not gonna show you, but my debit card and then my student ID card. Normally I have cash in there, but I don't because I used it to do my laundry earlier today. That's everything that I keep in my purse or in my school bag or whatever. Uh, it's really nice not having to carry around textbooks anymore. I still have textbooks, I just don't really carry them around. They normally just stay in my room with me, so that's really nice. Um, let me know if you guys want any more like college or school based videos. They're really fun to film. I think I'm going to stick with this filming setup minus the sheep. So hopefully I won't have those drying anymore just because I think this is really nice. I need to get a tripod. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!